I'm Arvada Mayor Mark Williams. I'm at Arvada High School, which is just filled with so much incredible history. And to give you a sports analogy, it's poised for a comeback. To tell us more about the exciting things happening here at Arvada High School, we have Dan Quaratino, who's been here for five years as the athletic director of Arvada High School, and the brand new principal, Shannon Vigil. Welcome to you both, and thanks for doing this. Thank you. Yeah, thank you. So tell us a little bit about this pathway program that I've been hearing about. You know, we're, we're fortunate to have this program. Uh, it means a lot to our kids, our community. We know professional athletes go on and play, but we know that only 1% of our population goes on to be that professional athlete. So what do we do with those 99%? What we have is we do sports business. I'll give you an example is right now, our kids are creating a promotional video. So they create their own content, they make the promotional video, and then uh, from there, they're going to make one for Arvada High School. We're also looking at uh, developing, we got this shirt that's coming out, so the kids will develop the logo, will develop everything from the sports business side of things, and then they'll market that into our community, at our feeder schools, and, and beyond. So it's a lot of fun, it's a lot of hands-on, you don't have to be an athlete to like this. You can be a theater kid, you can be a band kid. So beyond this incredible Pathways program, there's some talk and it's gonna take a lot of fundraising, it's going to take a lot of community input but there's a program that's being talked about involving one of the great uh, individuals in the history of Arvada High School, Irv Brown, who was a coach here, who went on to be a well-recognized sportscaster and, and talk radio host and referee, um, who is remembered as, as a really dynamic, great guy. Um, there's talk about tying something in with his legacy here, if indeed we can get the stars to align with both funding, community input. Uh, but tell us a little bit about what that might look like. I think if we could partner and, and build the Irv Brown Championship Center, that would be great for Arvada High School. And we would love to honor Irv's um, legacy and tradition here at Arvada High School, where he was our state championship baseball coach. We could have state-of-the-art media facilities for students to learn in high school, college-level skills. They could learn to um, do video editing and podcasts, and they can learn how to print media and do all those things in this tradition you know, of, our, of Irv, but in a 21st century setting. And I think that'd be fantastic. We'd love to do that. And, and hopefully someday in the future we can. We'll talk to the kids about the wonderful career opportunities in sports management, sports marketing, sports health and performance, sports journalism, which is my background, or coaching. There's five wonderful career pathways on the business side of sports. And these kids here at Arvada High School are, are getting a, a full dose of it. Super excited about everything that we're doing at Arvada High School. I think Arvada is poised to really rebound. We've had some decreases in our population, but I think we're gonna come back up. And I think part of that is because the programs we're offering. Well, one of the things I love about being part of Arvada is watching great things come together. I'm really excited about this and thank you both for what you're doing for our students, what you're doing for our community. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.